Grace Before Eating If I can, I begin by having an open door. In the best of all worlds, facing east. The eighth dimension is the law of the universe, the fundamental rule that holds us together. Love, the moral arc. The seventh is nothingness, the space between matter, the possibility of and in impossibility that exist in those spaces between what we know. The sixth dimension is cause and effect, and here I tend to be pretty literal. My responsibilities, the tasks that I have set for myself, accepting that I am accountable for all my actions and inactions, a long list each day, but through the law of cause and effect, a balanced meal does in fact have an impact. The fifth dimension is both a prayer that my will and desire is harmonious with the way of good. It is also a prayer of thankfulness for all the good in my life, gratitude. The fourth dimension is an acknowledgement of the community that I exist in, naming all family, friends that I think of, hold in my heart, interact with. It is a long list that I usually organize by calendar days. The third dimension is the world that I live in, and here again, I look to face east, even if it's a wall. The second dimension is my place of being, my personal weather, how I am feeling. The first dimension is the line of which I am part, ancestors, deceased relatives and former lovers, acquaintances, past, and the living, family, comrades, and loved ones present, and a joy in knowing the children of the future. In the zero dimension, the point is an acknowledgement that I am next to nothing, a cipher in the universe. Just talking breakfast, so how do you like to take your coffee? Light and sweet.